best. You can't have that <laughs> 60s-inspired show without a tall beehive or a pompadour. And as TCL reporter Emily Engberg finds out, all you need for a little good do is a little foam and a very creative costume guy. One of the first wigs that I made, it was one of the prototypes, yeah, and so it's just kind of one of my favorites, and it just looks so amazing on her being sparkly, and, and your character is big, blonde, and beautiful, right? Yes. <laughs> As a parent volunteer, I'm here for them, and the reward are those big smiles. And you saw how they interact with yeah. me, and they're just so much fun to work with. Okay, talk about Kevin. Best part about working with him? His charisma. Yeah. <laughs> he tells Absolutely. a lot of jokes. Does he? Yeah. Like dad jokes? Oh, or is yeah. it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and what have you learned from him? I just learned that you have to have fun in theater in order to work with other people. Yeah. yeah. A lot of what we're doing is a lot of seriousness to what yeah. we're doing, and, and uh, it's a lot of hard work. It is hard work. You know, and to try to keep it light and lively. When the world keeps spinning round and round, and my heart's keeping time to the speed of sound. I'm when I look on stage, the kids are so talented, but those costumes, how much time is going into this? So uh, when I found out that we were going to do Hairspray yeah. last year in April, I started working on the prototypes to present to the director. So that was last May. They loved it, approved it. But they were like, Kevin, you realize you've got to make like 70 of these, right? You're like, oh. <laughs> I'm like, OK. And so I've really been working on these since May, June of last year. It's been over nine months. All right, got to talk about the headpiece. How does it feel on your head? It's so heavy, but it's really <laughs> worth it to have like this and pull off the part. Do you love doing this? Yeah, I actually do dance, so it's really fun in musicals when they choreograph the dancing and then how it's kind of related to what you do. So, what did I miss? Each piece is different. All of them yep. look so crazy, but they're foam, right? Yeah, so there's basically three different kinds of foam. So you've got foam like you'd find in your chair seat. It's okay. like acoustic foam. Okay. Then I also used pool noodles that are shaved down Stop and it. sliced. Yeah, Link, uh, with the, the Elvis yeah. wig, that one's yoga mats. Stop it! That were cut up. I have to touch yeah. it. This is so interesting. When you first got it, did it instantly put you into the character and you go, oh, now I get it. Yeah, I loved it because um, I really liked it because it was different from the others and I don't know, it just, it feels good. <laughs> so if you think it's fun on stage, backstage is even more fun because this is where they all are hidden. Emily, you've got to try this oh one. Oh gosh, on. this is hilarious. I like this too because it's so big. It is pretty light, but I mean, this is a lot of work. We've got the wig caps that the kids are wearing and that actually helps provide some traction yeah. to keep it on their heads. And then um, we also will use large bobby pins to help okay. in certain places, just like you do with a real wig. I want to see this big orange one. So this is Edna's makeover wig. This okay. is the acoustic foam, and this is the wig that I would use and do a pattern with, yeah. and then cut out the pattern, and then each one of these had to be individually cut out and sort of oh, spiraled by me. And, my goodness. And what did I miss? America, I made it myself. Is that her line? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what the, where the sass comes from. As soon as I put the hat on, now I get it being in See, character. It's carrying <laughs> yourself differently, right? As soon as you put on those hats. Well, I like the sparkle. You guys sparkle. This is so much fun. A blast today. Oh, that is just too cute. We've made a determination. Uh, more schools need more Kevins in their <gasps> school. I mean, um, look at all the life and the zest that he has going into a middle school production. It'll look so fun. I know. You know, we're not the only ones that are uh, buzzing about the wigs Kevin made. BuzzFeed oh. caught wind of his dedication and posted a feature on their Instagram page. <laughs> they did this over the week.